A very good afternoon everybody, Austin back with another video. So today I went on an impromptu shopping spree. I was in Taunton working, I googled window cleaning supplies on Google and it brought me up with the name of a shop which I will talk about in a minute. So I wanted to upgrade my normal bucket which you can see is the Unger 18 litre bucket quite here so it's an overhead camera shop today so there's my 18 litre bucket as you can see all of my hand tools stowed away they're all cleaned ready for the next day but they're all stowed away and as you can see with my squeegee it doesn't quite fit in the box so it's an 18 litre bucket the under squeegee I have is 17 and a half inches so I needed a bigger bucket. I was searching online, found many companies that make window cleaning buckets, but of course, Unger was my number one choice. I favor the brand, I like the design, it's robust, rugged, and works for me. Your opinion may differ, but my opinion is Unger, so we're very happy. So move that 18 meter bucket out of, out of frame. In comes the 28 litre bucket I purchased. Again, robust design, a lot bigger, fantastic handle with an indent so the handle always stays up. Uh, the lid, waterproof lid, fantastic quality, embossed with the under logo. So inside the bucket, very spacious, very roomy, it's marked out with litres and gallons. As you can see, very clearly listed inside. I will be trying to find a clip-on strainer for this or some form of hanger system so I can hang tools inside. Unfortunately, the supplied Unger squeegee hanger doesn't fit this bucket profile, but it's not a problem. That was complimentary. I will be getting a hanger system for it or some kind of insert tray. I'll either make it myself out of perforated aluminium, but that is the 28 litre bucket. Very happy with it. It's a lot bigger in comparison to the 18 litre. As you can see, the 18 litre bucket actually fits inside of the 28 litre bucket. So that's my bucket. Prices may vary depending on where you buy them from. This one here, I had a fantastic deal on and the company that I found in Taunton Somerset I cannot recommend them highly enough I will talk more in depth about the company in a separate video and it will be the video that's posted today above or below this video so as you can see the company in question is Blade Right Blade Right are a small company based in Taunton, Somerset on the industrial estate. They're on Blade Right Unit 1C, Chelston Road, Chelston Wellington, Taunton, TA 21 9JQ. Blade Right. Blade Right. I highly recommend them. My next video. I talk more about Blade Right and we'll give a review and a business recommendation. So that's the bucket. Very happy with the bucket. Nice positive locking lid also on that one as well. So a few accessories or a few new additions to my kit. First and foremost, that's my biggest squeegee. I tend to use that one every day. And my new addition, my little baby, my six inch channel and rubber that I purchased today, along with the new handle, Ergo Tech of course, but I've not seen this type of handle before. I haven't got this before, so 
something new fresh very nice as you can see tiny tiny little channel six inches like all the ergo tech range clips in give it a press just to pierce the rubber so a brand new six inch squeegee will be fantastic for smaller shop windows above doors also georgian style windows and glazing which i deal a lot with and the next thing i wanted was a pole compatible scraper forever removing sellotape stickers and all the gash and crap that people stick on glass so i went for the 10 centimeter which is the ergotech glass scraper i've already got a plaster on my finger i was leaking some blood some blood fell out of my finger earlier when i opened this up for the first time so that is the ergotech 10 centimeter uh, scraper quick release blade slide in slide out left and right the standard handle that we're all familiar with which is fantastic as i can pole mount that light very lightweight very well made comes with a blade guard on there i will see if i can find a holster that's compatible for this or if not i'll end up making one but that's the scraper and i also picked up a packet of rb romeo bravo 100 10 stainless steel blades for that particular scraper as you can see 10 blades stainless steel and that's my new addition really so new kit didn't go silly didn't spend lots of money it was under 70 pounds for the bucket including the lid the scraper the also the squeegee the channel the rubber and the blades so that is my new addition or my kit upgrade so then that will complement the rest of my kit that i use daily so i have my standard squeegee i have the next one down as you can see i found this one today this pulex in a charity shop dirt cheap and then i have my applicators or strip washers i will try to find a little six inch one now that's all i need but as you can see that is all of my traditional kit all of the hand tools i use so i think i'm very happy now i i i think i've got everything i would really wish for i was looking at the unger stingray that's something i'm yet to decide upon i might buy a, another unger telescopic pole I have plenty of scrims, various cloths, various soap. I might buy the 15 centimeter scraper shortly and maybe another intermediate size squeegee. But that is pretty much it. So new, new, new scraper, the squeegee channel rubber blades and the awesome Unger bucket, 28 litres from Blade Right in Taunton, Somerset. So if you like the video, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them below in the comments. If you'd like to subscribe, I'd appreciate that. Share it with your friends. Thank you very much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your afternoon and have a very good weekend.